of us moms would love to spend as much time as possible with our kids, right? And according to our circumstances, most of us try to. I feel very lucky and grateful that most often I can work from home, thanks to my show. And sometimes my kids are part of my work too. Not everyone would like this. Some people like to get away to an office to work and then come back to their children. And that's fine too. As I always say, each to their own. For instance, I had this magazine photo shoot with Zen and Kai where mothers from different professional fields were being featured with their children. Initially, I was a little apprehensive because you need a lot of patience for a photo shoot with children. This was their first photo shoot. One smile or one shot from a child can sometimes take a second and at other times it can take forever. It all depends on their mood. I too had to constantly encourage them. Very short and sweet and uh, exhausting even though short because with kids shooting is a whole different ball game. And as I was saying babies are still easier than toddlers because these guys of course have their own mind and body. So do babies but babies are restricted by their mood. Children are so innocent, they assume that whatever they set their heart on is theirs. Like this teddy bear. That you'll have to ask them. Can I take the teddy bear? Come on. Take it for you. Tantrum. Mama. Tantrum on the fence. <laughs> Many mums would love their child to be in front of the camera. I believe that all this is alright as long as it's fun and unobtrusive for the kids. We shouldn't put any kind of pressure or stress on our children. Like this show, we capture our lives as they are. No pressure on our kids ever. Oh, after the photo shoot, Rupak joined us too. Both the children were really excited to see their daddy. Rupak and I have always tried to take time away from our hectic schedules for some family time. And that is how we wound up at the shoot. Bye. Bye. That was a fun shoot, very quick, short and sweet. Then uh, daddy came and now we're, we're going home. Come. Parents, their children's education is of course extremely important. I too wait eagerly each day for Zen to come home from school and tell me all about the new things he learned. Each day Zen comes back with something new, sometimes new experiences and sometimes new learnings. Can I see? Today it's a paper bag Easter bunny which he's made with the help of his teacher. short day, it's only two hours, so by the time he's sort of gone and I've done the gym and a little bit of work, he's back. <laughs> Come, let's go say hi to your brother. You want to show him your Easter bunny back? Come, you show it to him, you show it to him. Hi! Happy, happy to see you. Kai and Zen are quite excited to see each other. After school, they give each other great company. <laughs> Our children have an age difference of two years, although everybody has their own opinion. In our case, I believe that having a small age gap means they play, fight, love, fall and grow up together. <laughs> Without realizing it, children at this age can sometimes get a little rough with younger children. That's why you need to keep a careful watch. After returning from school, I encourage Zen to discuss what he did and learnt in school. It's interesting because people say don't put pressure on kids uh, when they're too young, but I find that I guess every child is different, but Zen really enjoys 
doing this kind of thing if he's in the mood of course but i find if i ask him things he really enjoys doing it i think you know if you spend some time with them doing things together like this it really really um helps and i think they enjoy it every parent should try and make sure that they are communicating with their children what is that spider man very good what is that spider yeah at this age a lot can be taught to a child through play my friend and leading child psychologist dr zirak marker told me something very interesting about this तो मैंने भी ये देखा है अभी मेरे भी दो छोटे बच्चे हैं कि वो लोग इतना जल्दी सीखते हैं समथिंग हैज बिन सेड एंड आई डोंट इवन नो हाउ ही विल रिमेंबर एंड लाइक थ्री वीक्स लेटर से ओ मामी इट इज थिंग फ्रॉम जीरो बर्थ के बाद टिल सेवन और एट इयर्स ऑफ एज दे से नाइन्टी परसेंट ऑफ लर्निंग इज डन रियलीज बॉर्न लाइक अ क्लीन स्लेट तो फर्स्ट वर्ड्स फर्स्ट स्टेप्स फर्स्ट टाइम द चाइल्ड होन्स अ पेंसिल first time he you know feels emotion so there's so much happening in the brain and there are so many uh, neurological neurons forming learning pathways in the brain and apparently that's why you know studies show and clearly indicate that 90% of learning is done by the age of 6 or 7 wow. and so is the brain development as well nowadays some play schools teach children using fun and easy learning methods a very effective method they use in zen school is a fun and concentrated teaching of phonics in which initially the child is not taught regular a b c rather the sounds of the letters like a for apple b for ball for cat can you sing us that song about ants and to my ants and to my ants and to my ants ko li mi ara sometimes a quick revision even if through play when the child returns from school is a good thing Up ahead is my life centered around my kids. Oh, Raina Singh! Raina Singh, that Peppy went and did potty. जब बच्चे को फीवर होता है, तो डॉक्टर को कब बुलाना चाहिए? ये थोड़े बच्चे की उम्र के हिसाब से भी होता है। अगर कोई तीन महीने के अंदर किसी को भी कभी बुखार हुआ, तो I think डॉक्टर को फॉरेन बुलाना चाहिए। I was there and uh, the whole experience of being at the hospital going through the whole delivery process and then finally holding that little one in your hands it's, uh, it's it's really really beautiful it's amazing Kai is now taking his afternoon nap So Zen and I are going to go in quietly to get his toys so that we can play in our garden Sleep time for Kai and play time for Zen. It's amazing to see how fertile a child's imagination can be. Zen is now getting his toy dogs ready for the garden. The imagination of a two and a half year old fascinating. I am so amused half the time with the things he's doing, the stories he's telling himself. And I look back and I remember when I was a child, I remember doing this. I used to take a bicycle and drop off my toys at various places to school and tuitions and things like that. And I spent a lot of time talking to myself and playing games in my head, which I think a lot of children do, and it's beautiful. Nowadays, Zen brings his three dogs out for a walk. Like most children, he has given them names. Oh, Raina Singh! Raina Singh, that Peppy went and did potty. Zen is so good; he's taking them to do potty. We're so lucky to have this open space. Again, I'm grateful to my father and my husband for finding a building which has this, and so the kids get this outdoor space to play in. We should allow kids to explore on their own. You never know when they'll surprise you with their new discoveries. This is something I learned from my parents. Being an author, my dad wrote a lot of books. Quite a few were stories for children. 
During my childhood, my parents encouraged my sister and me to make up stories of our own. Seeing Zen do the same thing, I'm sure Daddy is watching and must be very happy. After playtime, it's nap time for Zen. Nap time is very important to recharge your children's energy. And while Zen and Kai nap, I use the time to do some work and connect to you on social networks. Tahi Noja Sharma from Guwahati connected with me. Her question is that children often have some health issues. How are we to know when it is necessary to take them to the doctor? Hi Tahin, a doctor can best answer this question. So I asked Dr. Ajit. जब बच्चे को फीवर होता है तो डॉक्टर को कब बुलाना चाहिए ये थोड़े बच्चे की उम्र के हिसाब से भी होता है अगर कोई तीन महीने के अंदर किसी को भी कभी बुखार हुआ तो आई थिंक डॉक्टर को फौरन बुलाना चाहिए लेकिन थोड़े बच्चे बड़े हो जाते हैं तब अगर बुखार होगा और कोई दूसरा लक्षण नहीं है बुखार का और बच्चा अदरवाइज बुखार उतरता है तब खेलता रहेगा तो आई थिंक यू कैन वेट बिकॉज नॉर्मली कोई भी बुखार एक दो दिन में समझ में आ जाता है कि कहाँ से कहीं खांसी शुरू हो जाती है कहीं लूज मोशन चालू हो जाते हैं कुछ ना कुछ होके विच गिवस एस एन आइडिया वेदर फीवर इज कमिंग फ्रॉम सो डोंट पैनिक गिव देर इज फीवर फीवर इज यूजली अ फ्रेंड बॉडी इट इज बॉडीज रिस्पॉन्स टूवर्ड्स इन्फेक्शन सो वी डोंट रियली वरी अबाउट फीवर बट वी इट लाइक टू कीप द चाइल्ड कम्फर्टेबल ड्यूरिंग द फीवर सो अगर फीवर स्टार्ट बॉदरिंग द चाइल्ड देन यू ट्रीट इट एंड द फीवर गोज ऑन बियॉन्ड टू डेज देन डेफिनेटली कॉल इट ऑफ I spend time with my children every day. But today I have the chance of spending time with more children. I have been invited as chief guest for a children's talent show. Here is the wonderful Maureen Wadia. This is Maureen Wadia judging uh, the Glad Rags Little, little Master Mister India and Little Miss India. And honestly Maureen you have more energy than anyone. <laughs> It's amazing. Thank She's you. run between the races and between the paddles right. and between the judging, and she Thank does it all with such grace and you know competence. Amazing, amazing. So tell Thank us you. a little bit about the little Miss and Master India contest is in its second year, and it's a little contest meant for all the uh, little children in the ages two to nine and nine to sixteen. And today we're going to line them up right now. India contest and they all look so cute Zen is going to come shortly and I'm sure he's going to be besotted with all the little girls I believe that all children have some kind of talent and so we should keep encouraging them so they build their confidence Zen and Kai also joined me in the award ceremony. This was a new experience for them too. A new place and meeting so many children of their own age. Seeing the talent and enthusiasm of so many young children at this event gave me a lot of joy. I believe at this age one shouldn't judge children as winners or losers and so we decided that all the children were winners. So it's been a wonderful event and uh, Zen and Kai are here and Gaga has come as well and it's been fun and full credit to Maureen for pulling it off. Thank you. We should always encourage little children and try and make sure they aren't going through any stress or pressure. This is very important for their overall development. So let them live life to the fullest. Let them explore things without any fear so that they can spread their wings and learn to fly. Everyone wants what's best for baby. Today we will talk about baby wipes. A child's skin is 3 times more sensitive than an adult's. Their delicate skin has a natural protective layer which knowingly or unknowingly can get damaged from repetitive wet cleaning. Scientific research has observed that when we use a wet napkin or towel to clean our children, especially during a nappy change, the child starts getting rashes. So, it is necessary to use soft and gentle wipes that are made especially for a child's delicate skin. Johnson's baby wipes have a special double care system. 
They are made using soft wave technology, because of which the friction is reduced to a minimum. These wipes also have in them Johnson's Baby Lotion, which leaves behind a protective layer on the child's skin. Whether it is cleaning the hands or face of growing children or cleaning little babies during a diaper change, Johnson's Baby Wipes are useful for every age. They are soap-free and alcohol-free and have the Johnson's clinically proven mild stamp. I was there and uh, the whole experience of being at the hospital, going through the whole delivery process and then finally holding that little one in your hands, it's, uh, it's, it's really, really beautiful, it's amazing. The typical Mumbai life, which is a middle class life of a young child, is my life, although we were from a film family, but I think my parents kept it very normal for us. When you are going to become a parent, the joy you feel is unquantifiable. My friend Vivek Oberoi shared his feelings on the subject with me. It's amazing. I mean, I've never imagined it would be like this. I, I take a flight between Mumbai and Delhi and I snooze out and suddenly I'm imagining I'm holding my, my child in my arms and yeah. holding um, my baby and talking to uh, my baby. I mean, it's crazy. It's, it's, um, it's just something overwhelming and it, even before we've had uh, our child, it's something that just kind of just consumes you. It's beautiful. But I think you've also, you've just, you've just got a nephew, right? So you've got That's these right. Of That's having right. a chota sa baby in the house. I was there and uh, the whole experience of being at the hospital, going through the whole delivery process and then finally holding that little one in your hands. It's, uh, it's, it's really, really beautiful. It's amazing. Vivek is now a father, so I sincerely wish him and his wife Priyanka all the very best. Now a chat with a dear friend who shared his childhood experiences with me. Today we have the very talented star Tushar Kapoor ke saath. and Tushar you don't have kids so I won't ask you too much about babies but uh, tell us about your childhood. My childhood is in Mumbai. We used to go to Bombay and I went to Bombay Scottish School and uh, I was a bandra boy and I used to play with the building kids coming, after coming from school, do my homework. Come home by 8, 8, 30, have dinner, watch a little bit of TV, go to sleep. The typical Mumbai life, which is a middle class life of a young child, that was my life, although we were a film family. But I think my parents kept it very normal for us. Yeah, that's what I was going to ask you. That a star kid, was that a lot of pressure? I think the, I mean, the excitement was there because we loved our father's profession and we loved movies. So we grew up on his films, we watched his films. But our dad never came to school in the school mein aaye bhi nahi, and uh, I think our life was from the studio, from the film industry, from the film industry, from the film industry. So it was a very usual, normal, ordinary kid's life. Yeah. So now, now you don't have any children, but maybe there will be plans to settle and having kids. Of course, kids. Um, uh, I'm like actually jumping to the idea of having kids and I've not even thought about marriage. So I don't know how that's possible. <laughs> yeah. So are you good with kids? I'll be amazing with kids. I think uh, I'll be a very, very good father. I think I'll be all. I thi really think you will. Actually, I know Tushar from childhood. From childhood, as in when we were in school, in yeah, school yeah, days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So teenagers. I really, yeah, teenagers. teenagers. So I, I can also vouch for the fact that in kids, बहुत बहुत अच्छे values है. Uh, although of course he's a star kid and now a star, I think he's really humble and he's all the right values. So, आप बच्चों को क्या message देना चाहेंगे values के बारे में या क्या सिखाना चाहेंगे? I think uh, kids are very, very sharp. They're, they're very receptive. So anything happy happening in your mind, in your life, in your body language, what you're doing, even if you're not communicating with them, they pick those things up. Absolutely. So you can't really lie to your kids. 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 So I think uh, one has to um, make a lot of sacrifices for your kids. That, that's very, very true. And uh, I think I'll be all the things that my parents probably could not be with me. You know, there's so many things that we feel that our parents have missed. You know, this is the same thing, that 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 is the same thing. From another angle, I think you also do a lot that your parents did. Yes, you, you learn know, like from them and you learn did. from their mistakes yeah, also. <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. So, are you close to your mother or your father close to your or both? I was closer to my mom. She was a great mom. She was very involved. She had a lot of time for us. She never chose to choose parties on our own. She always chose 
being mm. with us in the evenings as her priority. Yeah. लेकिन माय आई फील माय मॉम वाज रियल वेरी स्ट्रिक्ट आई थिंक लाइक ऑल आवर पेरेंट्स आई थिंक मेरी माँ आई थिंक थोड़ी ज़्यादा ही स्ट्रिक्ट थी थोड़ी ज़्यादा ही मतलब सख्त थी जो आई थिंक आई विल नॉट बी आई थिंक आई विल प्रॉबेबली more more interactive and more like how i am with you right now i'll be like that with my kids yeah and <laughs> hopefully I hope, I hope. yeah and tell me ekta to aapke behan hai and are you very close what kind of relationship like friends, you have but uh, bachpan mein bahut jhagda karte the hum huh. shayad isliye humne ek matlab ek line bana diya hai ki abhi hum क्लोज हैं भाई बहन हैं लेकिन आप अपनी जगह मैं अपनी जगह सो दैट्स द आई थिंक द पाथ दैट वी हैव क्रिएटेड फॉर सेल्फ बिकॉज एज किड्स वी हैव वी हैव फॉट लाइक डॉग्स विद फाइट यू नो लाइक हाउ डॉग्स विद फाइट फॉर मनी ऑन द रोड यू नो यू सी इन द मूवीज दैट्स हाउ वी फॉट नो बट ऑनेस्टली आई थिंक दैट हैपन्स विद सिबलिंग्स नाउ दैट आई हैव टू लिटिल बॉयज आई सी लॉट्स ऑफ लव एंड लॉट्स ऑफ लिटिल फाइट सो आई थिंक साथ 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 तो साथ है। मेरी और मेरी बहन की उम्र मतलब डेढ़ साल का ही डिफरेंस है हमारे बीच सो आई थिंक दैट्स वाई वी यूज टू फाइट लॉट थैंक यू सो मच रियली रियली थैंक यू ट्रूली वी ऑल लर्न हाउ टू रेज चिल्ड्रन फ्रॉम आर ओन एक्सपीरियंसेस एंड आवर चिल्ड्रन टीच अस सम थिंग्स एज वेल सो नो बडी इज एन एक्सपर्ट एवरीवन इज लर्निंग आई टू कंसीडर माय सेल्फ अ स्टूडेंट इन दिस जर्नी ऑफ लाइफ एंड सो एज अ स्टूडेंट I would love your advice, suggestions and comments. Do write in to us on our Facebook, Twitter and blog. Also a very happy Diwali to all of you and your families and especially your children. Next week's episode we are going to be in Kalimpong with the family. We'll meet some relatives and share lots of love, adventure and hopefully joy. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> chat with a special friend subah subah aapko ja ke apne aap ko mirror mein dekhna chahiye and you have to say today is a new day and at the end of the day you can cry in the bathroom